takes it gang what he do hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Kala Khazami I'm Khazami if you're new here please do not forget to hit the subscription button if you're a recent subscriber welcome back guys I'm lost <laughs> I'm lost not having a car I'm telling you I don't know what's he Nyeshe in the wrong place but Rosebank Moliki so the restaurant did you get thank you for the security and like <laughs> this is <me> literally <laughs> running because like it was looking a little bit dodgy because i was just like am i lost or what and the street was so empty like there were people there and there and then i was finding my way a little found my way guys let's have a whole little tea and it is so cold yo we are banned i'm fair too yeah, yeah. I finally found restaurants and I had to go and look for Paco and I found her and we decided to get some coffee because it was cold. Say hi to my YouTube channel, Paco. Paco Welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh -huh. <laughs> so today we're at a coffee shop. Uh, yeah. 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 We finished with the coffee and we decided to go to Egg because Gorgeous Sambali was going to be there. I was so nervous, guys. We... Yeah, I was nervous. I couldn't even go back. But we went to the Hamas of Law inside the Egg. And let me tell you something. Let's give Gorgeous Sambali her flowers. Because the store and the decor, please. <laughs> After that meeting gorgeous in Berlin, I couldn't do it. So me and Paco decided to go and have food. I thought maybe I was gonna come down and be okay and be able to go back. Let me tell you something. I didn't go back. I couldn't do it. But we went to Mama Mama Samba to have some food because this was our meet up me and Paco it was aesthetically pleasing the place was scrumptiously answer nice proper but let me tell you something the food mm -mm. it was not giving what it was supposed to give okay no, 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 no. But the aesthetics, like, the place is beautiful. Like, let me tell you something. The place was gorgeous, beautiful. Like, everything and more. So this is what I ordered. That's what Paco ordered. Order, Paco ordered a glass of wine. I was drinking Coke. And, yeah, man, the food. Yes, <laughs> And I went to the toilet, take some um a bathroom selfie, nyana. The place is giving, like the aesthetics is there, like yo, ah, uh, uh, the place is proper. Wow, wow, wow. Today we are trying something new. Kata, I'm gonna like it. So, gonna help. Uh huh. Mitol. Yay. Wait, Ramulika Mudimu. Ramulika, like there is a what do they call egg poach? What, 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 what? It's a I'm not going to be 
And then we are done eating. The aesthetics we're giving. We're leaving. We're done eating. We're going outside. Okay. Outside. Okay. 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 Today I met Gorgeous and Valley. I am so happy. What an amazing human being. But oh, if you know me, you know that I love Gorgeous and Valley. Like, yo, seeing her today. Shem. I mean, in the Kinale Park, like I was with Park my friend. And when I saw her, I was so speechless. I, I, I couldn't say anything. Yo, guys, I mean, that woman, scrumptly Anza, I, ho I, I pray that God blesses her. And she must continue being the woman that she is because wow, she was so friendly, she was so nice. I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. I couldn't even go back because my friend like Baku was like, yeah, we can go back and stuff. I was like, ma'am, I can't. I can't. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. Nikiri speechless. Eh, ke frizzy. Eh, ke batahola. Woo! I being a crying baby is not nice. Next time, I'm gonna give myself a pep talk. Oh, your favorite influencer. But hey, man, I wish God blesses her and she must continue being as humble as she is, loving, amazing. Wow. Wow. What a, what a human being. What a human being. What a human being. But, anyways, let me tell you something about. Um, I don't review him. Momanak. What is that place gonna let go? Echo Rose Bank. Everybody keeps on going to talking about and all of that. Mm, go there for drinks. Food. They were under seasoned. Cause Odile noodles, pork noodles, something, something. My friend Odile rice and um the seafood, what 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 the I the food were under seasoned. It was very underwhelming. The aesthetics is beautiful. The restaurant is very, very beautiful. I would say you should go there. But to eat, maybe drinks, yes. But eating, I guess Anna, you will be disappointed. I'm telling you. You will be disappointed. You will be disappointed. But anyways, guys. What a beautiful day, man. We can close off July. Like, Kesha, Like, July, you can close. Like, I'm fine. Birthday month, I was more scrumptiously answer everything I expected and more. Bye, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, okay? Don't forget to subscribe. Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Lal Khosimei Mohaz. If you're new here, please do not forget to hit the subscription button. If you're a recent subscriber, welcome back. Gang and Gampan Black, period. Let us go to a Justine. It was not an event. It was a promotion something. They said we must wear black. So I wore black. So yeah, let's go. Back in Rosebank again, they were running a promotion of the new tissue oil repair. Um, it's the new tissue oil active repair that helps you when you are like exercising and you have pains and all of those things. So it's the new range. So we're introducing it and we're promoting it at a gym. So that is what I was going to do. As you all know, I'm the Justine Business Theater and also Justine Training Ambassador. So this was here. This was us here promoting it at the gym. So yeah, and they had a, they could stand a chance of winning one of the. Um, packages they just had to enter to win and this was also a competition on the justin instagram page 20 years later hello hello my beautiful people welcome back to my youtube channel my name is if you're new here please don't forget to hit the subscription button if you're a subscriber welcome back again again, again point black period so right now i am wearing my gym fit i don't know if you can see it yeah, I'm just wearing crop top, I'm wearing a legging, I'm wearing shoes, and I'm wearing a cap because I'm going to run some little errands. Not like really I'm going to run errands, I am going to I'm going to look for winter clothes that are on sale. Because like today is the first of September. Happy spring! Finally, finally. Like finally marhafe. But it's a little bit chilly, which I don't understand why, because when I woke up in the morning it was hot. So boring 
so let's get ready and i've gotten ready i've already eaten i'm just drinking my coffee i'm drinking my coffee so let's go i discovered this shop that's called rfo i want to go check if they do have a sale because like they had a sale when i was at home and like they were selling shoes and I, I was able to buy my dad like sneakers so i'm just like i want to go there to check here in Joburg if they have a sale and i also want to go to Spotsing and i also want to go to Truett and i also want to go to jet like there's a lot of stores that i want to go to so let's go and see if i can find something so yeah and also my hair <laughs> what about me i will stay with my hair let me tell you how my brain works my brain works in a way that when like if i don't have plans i'm not doing my hair i don't have like you know the the those girlies like every month they have like a budget for hair i don't have a budget for hair i don't have a budget for maintenance unless i'm going to do something that i'm going to do my hair or i'm gonna stay with that hair until i find something to do like if i want to do straight back then i can take off this and do straight back i'm not gonna take off the hair and stay with my natural hair me oh boy oh god said you go <laughs> so yeah and also what did i want to say okay so let's go and then yeah let's go let's go let's go i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are good and also i wanted to talk about um um i, I did a dedicated video talking about traveling and i didn't like the video and i don't know i just it just made me feel some type of way so these are my three tips or whatever tip I don't know if they're gonna be three or more than three when you're traveling solo name number one book your flight directly with the airline if you're gonna be using saa download the saa app or register your details on the saa app website buy your ticket from them so that if you have issues with your ticket you can complain directly to them don't use another website or that's just what i did and that's what i would advise you to do because it helped me a lot like when my flight was cancelled i could like um do run arounds and argue with them and do that so they could fix it because it was on their side i don't know if you do it with sky scanner it's the same route and also people were saying that when you book with sky scanner the price that you see there's not the price that you're going to pay they're going to charge you uh more than what is on that price because whatever 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 so book directly with the airline number two if you can book with the hotel website like directly from the hotel's website do that but you can also use booking.com but when you use bookings.com make sure that you say pay at the place or maybe pay half and make sure that the place that you're booking at it is it exists like in a sense of saying that um if it's a hotel maybe um, the hotel hotel maybe you're in nigeria you're coming to south africa you want to sleep at the hilton hotel get their email from the website like google it find their website or whatever send them an email to check if they have your reservation if you've reserved through bookies.com so that you don't get scammed and if you're traveling solo if me i would avoid using airbnb because airbnb doesn't really guarantee your safety especially if you're a woman you're traveling alone preferably book a hotel or a resort or a villa or whatever that has security and it's a valid place like you people can like you know that your safety is it's guaranteed you know so yeah and also what did i want to say um yeah like th that's it and also research about the car the country or the place that you want to visit if they have uber because like in kenya when i went to kenya they have uber so i could use uber even though uber stopped working when i was still there um and then yeah that's just my two cents and also like keep like also what helped me a lot is that you go on bookings.com you google the place you want to like you check like you search the place that you want to go to don't book immediately check that place like maybe six months in advance like maybe every day or every two days one day when you get to that you will see it on sale and then you can reserve it even with flight that's what i did because my flight the price that i paid is not the original like price that you're gonna pay if you get in there in the book um the price that i paid is the same price that i saw on skyscanner what i did was i kept on searching for the flights and the dates 
and sometimes the app will keep will keep your search and if that um flight is on say you get a pop-up message and then maybe when you get a pop-up message you can check or what's going on you see so yeah that is just my two cents i'm not very experienced when it comes to traveling so also it made me like when i did the video i was like i'm not really qualified to do this video because i've been to like outside south africa i've been to two countries one country i i was not traveling solo this one um second country i was traveling solo so am i really qualified to talk about traveling internationally and all the countries that i've traveled to were in africa i've never been outside africa so i feel like my advice is not gonna be yeah so maybe let me travel maybe on my 10th country then we can start talking about like pro tips on traveling and all of those things and also like when you are traveling solo lie okay <laughs> tell your lie like um lie to the uber driver and all of that because your safety comes first like just be like oh no my friends i'm gonna meet my friends day or my husband is coming or my boyfriend is coming or whatever the case might be because you never know who are you talking to you know just lie <laughs> just straight up lie and also when you are there at the new country make sure you buy the sim card immediately when you get there you know um i know people say when you buy the sim card at the airport is expensive but me i would preferably buy it there at the airport and then make sure that i'm connected and call your family and also like um book in advance and share your details with your family so that they know where you are so yeah that is my two cents so uh let's go and see if we have a winter sale because this is the perfect time to buy winter clothes when winter is ending this is the perfect time for you to buy winter clothes when summer is ending that's the perfect time for you to buy summer clothes so i want to go check out if i can find because i need two sweatpants because i'm abusing the sweatpants that i have because i i have like one favorite sweat okay i have two but my favorite one is the black one but i'm always wearing it so i just want to get like different design of a black sweatpants and another color maybe gray or whatever the case might be and i also want like a track top or whatever the case might be so let's go but i'm gonna put a little bit of a jacket because i don't understand this weather it's like it's hot but also there's like a bit of wind it's cold like what's going on what's cooking oil so let's go the tiktok girlies got me here okay so if you're looking for a vest please like i usually buy these vests it's 130 for two the black and white one and they last long okay like and they are strong so the tiktok girlies got me here for these leggings and these top they were like they're not see-through they're so affordable and blah, blah 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 that was my fit that is what i was wearing there was music in the background that's why i'm doing a voiceover that was my outfit because i saw that on the clip that i showed you my outfit check you couldn't see what i was wearing so i was just wearing a legging uh crop top and um sneakers and then um cap so that's basically me at the fitting room i was fitting those things that the tiktok girlies were recommending and say we must check it out and stuff so this is me fitting the air tights yeah the pants i don't know what they call it and the top so that's me wearing the top and the pants they look so nice cute i would definitely buy them if i wanted them like i, I i'm definitely gonna go back for the top maybe the bottom but the bottom it's giving very much tight eh? so i don't know but it's not see-through so it's perfect love it so much and that is the i was trying to show you the price of the top so the price is like um it, it's 90 rand and also the pants is also like um i think it's also 90 rand so yeah this is me going to the rfo to check the sale let me tell you they were selling total spots um leggings they were selling for sheeny stuff like there was and they were on sale like 80 rent these pens do you know how much they are in total sports oh my god if you have rfo near you go there go there it's just that um they didn't have what i was looking for which was um sweatpants and a top so i was just looking and browsing i already have um gym in leggings so 
there was no need for me to buy these ones because i already have them so you see the foshini like blazer oh my god and they were on sale and after that i went to total sports so this is me getting sneakers the obsession i have with the new balance 530 oh my god and they don't have eh? my size and then Elena i was asking that guy if they have my size Elena so i was like i would choose one of the two if they had a 530 my size i was gonna buy it like shoe I'm obsessed with this shoe. Like, for one day, like look at me wearing this shoe day two. Oh my god. Come on now. Those that get it, get it. Okay? Period. I look sickening. Like, given a like, I want you to know what you mean. There's no way that I'm leaving this thing. Are you dumb? <laughs> Yo guys, hi, I am a big Gabriel. If uh, what is this? Sports scene. Yo, my cousin. Hello, to her na happy girl. Her girl is a good. The dunked, I bought dunked. Um, but we can have to see him. Nike dunk low. In white and red. I want not to take a look like any, but anyways, Ritla wanna go be in like Ritla as is over up and Billy. So I bought these shoes because like 530, like Nikki was a new balance D530, but unfortunately they, they don't have my size. Chapterly machine, but I'm gonna put a picture here so that you can understand like what is the vision, what am I trying to create. Like I love those shoes, I'm obsessed with getting a good old. Yo, can you write a shame? And also, remember when I left, I was like, hey, when is winter is ending, clothes you'll find them on sale. Okay. I didn't find anything so, so winter on sale. But the sweatpants, it's in a total sports. Uh, yeah. It's really black because I was complaining that I'm always wearing my black ones. And I also bought the gray ones. They're very really gray. Again, it's really great. I hope you guys can see. And also, Kirikili Lane Hub. Kirikili Lane. Oh, I'm excited about that one. Woo! I'm sure you're going to see a video of me wearing them. Mogiri Tikans. This. One hello, Anya. Running errands. Kirikili Mogele Fela. One hello, Anya. Kirikili Chiming. So cute. So nice. They didn't have black. But I'm not complaining. But yeah. I bought this also and also what i wanted to say was like on the traveling tips name when you're traveling like before you travel like ask your bank if they offer you like traveling insurance because i remember stan bank offered me like traveling insurance for free so i didn't pay for traveling insurance when i traveled they gave me traveling insurance for free so ask your bank and also um avoid swiping when you are in an international trip because you will have interest rate exchange. What what? Kuro tla ro uro betu na lefa hundred thousand shoka pake lo na zero zero. What tla why? So when you are traveling, like ira ko re um exchange the chalete before you go. Like I I heard this other lady on Instagram saying that you can go, you can literally go to your bank and order the notes of where you are going. Like if you're going to Kenya or Mozambique or Dubai or. Paris or wherever you're going, you can go to your bank and order the notes prior. Maybe like the order those out that bukai bukai bukai. And also, I think that um, depending on what type of vacation you are taking, may not if I were to if I'm going to an island or whatever, then I don't need like it's not like I don't need to be going around doing tourist stuff. I would always choose all inclusive because buying food when you're international it can be kind of expensive it can be expensive i mean if you're staying at a place and they're offering all inclusive why not pay all inclusive and you know that everything is included you don't need to worry about buying food or whatever the case might be and you can just focus on shopping you know so yeah this is what i bought and i think we've come to the end of my vlog thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe 
and like comment and everything so yeah i'll see you after two weeks after two weeks i'm going somewhere with someone that's gonna be a little bit exciting because spring is upon us when you're not your hopper a bikini when you're not your bikini when you're not your body when you're not your meaning skate don't tell me probably easy so yeah i love you guys so much bye thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe bye